just for fun, here's a Blender rendering of a much more complex scene. As we see in the preview image here, it looks like a real room. And there's our two monkeys there. And I'm only going to do this once, but I'm going to have the uh, samples to set to 128. And we'll watch it take happen. This is using what's called an HDR in the Blender world. In order to create an HDR, what happens is someone in the real world, in this case in uh, an apartment, takes a camera and puts it on a tripod and then takes many, many pictures with uh, moving the camera, rotating it around in the, uh, on the tripod and pointing it up and pointing it down and then stitching all of them together. HDR stands for, I believe, I can't remember, I keep messing it up. It's not high dynamic. Oh, high dynamic range is what it was, right? So anyhow, this is <coughs> using a high dynamic range scene and then uh, putting the objects in that scene. So we, if we go back to the uh, non-rendered image, this is our area where we have the two monkeys and the camera over here. Let's see, there's the camera. So obviously it's not in the middle of the scene where the middle of the scene would be over here, probably. And then in the preview, we can go through and we can look at the scene. If I take it out of the, let's see if I can do this. Nope. Why is that not working? Hmm. I don't see our scene. Oh, okay, so I guess I can't view it without looking through the camera. So what I can do is let's grab the camera and rotate the camera around to maybe point it towards the center of the scene, which would be in the top of my screen image. It would be over here. So there's the camera. So I'm going to hit R to rotate and move the camera around. And then our monkeys are off the scene. Let's move one over into the view of the camera. Okay, I'm going to try and put it like about in the... How about right there and then I have to move it down down and away Okay, let's see what happens if we render that one with our monkey. Uh, its monkey is called Suzanne and she's not looking at us. Let's turn it around. So she's facing the camera at least. All right, let's render that one. And as you can see, this is quite a complex scene. And there we go. That's all she wrote for this video.